Sugar releases dopamine into the mesolimbic pathway, which is the reward pathway. It gives us pleasure in the same way that drugs do because sugar is a drug. Uh, it increases the amount of dopamine in the brain, but by doing so, it downregulates the dopamine receptor, which means that we have a little sugar bump or a dopamine bump, and then it crashes and quite often it ends below baseline. So what do we do? Well, we reach for more sugar and then it bumps again. And this is because we're downregulating this pathway, the bump is less. So now we're looking for more and more and more. And this is what we go for. We aim for the carbohydrates because we know the carbohydrates break down into sugar. And it has massive implications because sugar blocks the prefrontal cortex. It blocks our brain's ability to make sensible decisions. So this is why we will wake early hours of the morning and drive to McDonald's or a, a local garage, which I've done many times, might I add, for my sugar fix. It stops us from making sensible decisions. It makes us do, I don't know if I, I'm going to swear anyway, it makes us do dumb shit, essentially. So this is why, and, and all of this has just come from cortisol, by the way, and through, through other things. But this is why cortisol is so important.